Hello everyone, welcome to your spiritual liaison, one, two, three, where the truth will be told. Get your affirmations and your manifestations on through meditation. Love yourself, live your absolute best life and make sure that you get a good laugh on every single day. Hello, my amazing Pisces. Hello, my wonderful cross watchers. So this is the extended to the Aries reading, the recap was it looks like this Aries did something to you that they are they are not a, happy about. They're sort of ashamed of. There was a lot of confusion, bickering, and like disagreements. Um, this Aries is watching your dreams come true. They, it looks like they mess with your livelihood in some way, like mess with your finances in some way, and it caused you to walk away from them. It caused you to sort of wash your hands of them, like completely you know, like edit them, you you just cut them completely out of your life. They've watched some sort of transformation with you though, Pisces. Um, again, this Aries could have messed with your livelihood in some way financially. Some did something to you to harm you financially. Um, <clears throat> now they're heartbroken and hurt over the fact that you walked away and you do not want to move forward with them. Um, this could have been somebody who you were romantically linked to in some way. Um, also they want some sort of new beginning with you. They definitely want to come offer you something or tell you something or give you something. Um, and they're optimistic that things are going to go well, that you'll be happy to hear from them or see them. I don't get the energy that you are though, Pisces. Like it looks like you, I just see that you have worked very hard for something. Um, what happened between you and this Aries was very unfortunate. Um, it looks like I said, like you worked very hard towards something to get somewhere to do something. And it looks like um, you overcame some sort of betrayal by this Aries. Um, this Aries wants you to consider putting them first. They could feel like you put somebody else first or you put something else first. Um, but this Aries is watching you. They could be riding past your home. They could be, you know, asking mutual friends, how are you doing or coming, going past your job or something. Um, they're spying on you in some way. And this is somebody who you were romantically linked to. They tried to knock you off your game. Like, they tried to knock you down while you were doing well for yourself. Now they want some sort of new beginning because they see that you've transformed um, or you made some sort of transformation and now they want to be a part of that. So I'm going to pull a card from the Rebel deck. Um, <clears throat> one card. Okay. And that one card says, eat your fucking vegetables. Eat, eat some shit made by Mother Nature. Um, so this... this Aries um, could be in that energy where they're just like, okay, something wasn't healthy between you two. Something, because you know vegetables are, you know, really healthy, things like that. But it was something that was not healthy between you two. Um, and so, and it looks like, you know, you all had, there was a lot of disagreements between you all. Um, a lot of arguing, a lot of other people involved have some, other people could have had some sort of um, say so in this situation, but it looks like people, like I said in the, in the previous reading, it looks like people did not quite get um, the full story between you and this Aries. And so... It's like now that people sort of know what they did to you, that they tried to mess with your finances. You could have faced homelessness because of this or some sort of public embarrassment because of this, because your finances were thrown off. Um, like I said in the previous reading, it could have been due to them putting out some sort of rumor where people did not want to work with you. Or, um, or something that had, that messed with how you could pay your bills or provide for your family. So it looks like you were very worried about money for a while or something, Pisces. Um, but now it looks like you have, you're doing well for yourself. Um, in some aspect of your life, you could have gotten back what you lost tenfold. 
But now it looks like this Aries is the one who is stressed out, worried, and brokenhearted about something. The chariot card. Pisces, you could be in the public eye in some way. Well, this Aries is in the public eye getting a lot of attention. Um, or this because it came out on, on this transformation like this this um this six of wands like some sort of victory you're having um so you could be getting a lot of attention right now you could just be in the public eye in some way so maybe maybe you work with the public um or you're in the public eye in some way and this aries has watched you they've been watching um, so they, they're watching you sort of like go up the ladder or get on top of something, um, after you all separated and you walked away from a situation, they could be looking at you as very nurturing, caring, and giving, and they want to have a new beginning with you. Um, after messing with your livelihood, after having you all worried about finances and stuff like that, um, they could see that people love you. And so now, but it was something between you all that was very unhealthy, very unhealthy. Um, they want to see things move forward, but Pisces, I just don't see you doing that. I don't see you being on board with things moving forward. The Ace of Swords, you could feel like that they, that they were cold in how they handled something pertaining to you. Um... They want to overcome these obstacles, though. They want to, the, whatever you all have gone through, they want to overcome some sort of obstacle with you and have some sort of like new beginning. Um, this Aries may pop up out of the blue to offer you something because it looks like, and, and like I said, the Aries are not, like I don't know too many Aries who are like, really to themselves they're they're more extroverts or something and so but it looks like this Aries went into hermit mode due to some sort of heartbreak or pain or something that they went through feeling betrayed so this could have been their karma they could have did something really low to you to mess with your livelihood and now somebody could be doing something very low to them to mess with their livelihood um but it looks like you all did not have a healthy relationship um at all and now Pisces you could be in the public eye in some way and this Aries um, again we have the two of swords so something this Aries could have kept you something hidden from you so you wouldn't make a good choice they didn't want you to make a choice based off of facts or the truth or something so they kept something hidden from you um, Could have been an air sign involved in this with the letter C in their name that they worked with. Well, this this Aries could have a C in their name. Um, the first name, middle name, last name or something. But it looks like they, they wanted to keep something hidden from you so you wouldn't be able to make a good choice. Like you wouldn't be able to make, like you wouldn't put yourself first or do what was best for you in the situation. Um, yeah, there's a lot of cold energy in here. Very headstrong. Um, very, I want, I, it's my way or no way, regardless of how it affects you. Um, but this Aries wants, they want to come rushing in though, Pisces. They really do. Um, Spirit, what, what else do you want us to know about this situation with this Aries? Because it looks like they really do want to come rushing in to change something or have a conversation with you or something like that and try to rectify this. Um, they're really, really hurt. Um, so they could just be being to themselves, like staying to themselves just because they don't want people to sort of see them in that way or something. Like see them, they, they don't want people to see how hurt they really are. 
you get a knight of wands so they do want to come rushing in they want to have a conversation they want things to change they are um um they do want to see something like it's like they're going to go after after they're going to pursue you pisces in a way that they are not they don't want to be offensive because they know they've already burnt that bridge with you. So they don't want to be offensive or come off as like being like bombarding you or like. Um, so they don't want you to see them in a way where they're like being controlling. So this this Aries could be trying to humble themselves or something. It just looks like they're going to come in in a way, but they're they're. It's like they're not going to give up, though. They're not going to give up easily when it comes to trying to rectify this situation with you or getting you to see something from their point of view. But they're still keeping something, like hiding something, um, from you, though, Pisces, and it could be pertaining to finances. Looks like they're still hiding something. Uh-huh. Yeah. They 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 it's like and uh, an Aquarius could be involved in this too. Um it's like they're hiding something that they did or something that they said about you. You all had a very unhealthy past. This again, this could have been somebody who you were in a relationship with. You all had a very unhealthy past. Um, and it looks like they did something went to try to knock you off the top or like mess with your finances in some way. Pisces, you want to see things balance back out. It looks like you were worried about your finances for a while um, due to something that this Aries did. Um, and it looks like at this point, it does not, you, you're not looking to have anything new transpire or like resolve this issue. It looks like you've already washed your hands of the situation. This Aries know what they did hurt you. They now they're hurting. Um, they want some sort of like, they want things to be resolved between you all. Pisces, it just looks like you're not on board with that. It looks like you're looking to just have an even balance in your life, even give and take um, in your life. And that could be, so if this was a relationship and this Aries, there was an even give and take between you two. Um, it looks like that's something that a lesson that you learned, Pisces, not to be so giving of yourself in every way, where if someone is not giving back to you um, in a loving, supportive way or something. Yeah, the death card, this relationship, it, there's no resurrection in it. There's no, it's no resolve. It just looks like, but this Aries, they do want you to put a death to what you, how you see them, how you view them, how you feel about them though. They want that to come to an end. Um, they do want things to like that, whatever you all, the fighting, the disagreements, they do want to have a healthy relationship with you, though, Pisces. They really do. It's just that they don't see things. Um, and then with the four of wands, this could have been somebody who you were married to or that you lived with or they lived with you or something. Um, they want to they they are going. I said that they're going to try to pursue this like they want to see some sort of like happier times with you have celebrations with you, any blessings that you have coming in your life, they want to be a part of it. And when I said that, the devil card flipped out. So, mm-mm, 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 Pisces. If you have been thinking like, no way, no way in, in the world, like you burnt me, like you, like you burnt every bridge that there is to burn between a person, between two people. Like this person could have cheated on you. They could have lied. They could have stole money, finances, or hid money in finances in some way. 
um, causing a lot of confusion, you know, just causing a lot of problems or something. Um, you could have, like I said, you could have lost your home or your livelihood. They like they could have messed with your livelihood in some way financially, where you could have had almost faced homelessness, or you did face homelessness, or you could not provide for your family the right way. And they were behind this, and you could have find, found out Pisces. Now other people are sort of like looking at them in a very negative way. Like, how could you do something so low? And now it has people looking at them like, well, if you'll do that to Pisces, you'll do that to me too. Um, or you'll attempt to. So Pisces, this, this Aries is still very controlling. They're still hiding something. They're still playing a bunch of manipulation games. They're still not coming to the table being quite honest. Um, and, and it's be, and the only reason they're coming back Pisces is because you're getting some sort of like public recognition. So, like I say, you could be in the public eye due to some sort of hard work, um, something that you worked hard towards. You could be in the public eye, but it really looks like this, this Aries is just, um, coming back because they see you doing very well for yourself. So they do want to have some sort of like celebration with you, but it just looks like the damage has been done. Like when somebody messes with your livelihood, they don't care whether what what happens to you. They don't care whether you live or die at that point. So it's it, it just looks like this Aries is still being very manipulative with this devil card. As soon as I said that, like I was shuffling the cards and then the devil card came out. So this Aries is still withholding information, still trying to control the situation. It's like it's like they want to have a relationship with you, but the relationship has to be on their terms only. They have to be in control of it. Um, and I don't see you standing for this, Pisces. I don't see you even willing to, I don't even see you willing to um, allow them back. So if they're, if they're convincing themselves that three cards fell out, so I'm not going to take all of those, but if they're convincing themselves that you're going to take them back and that you should just be happy to have them in your life. And that's a very arrogant stance. Um, and it looks like Pisces, you don't care whether you see them again or not. That's just where you are. Somebody to mess with your livelihood. Somebody to mess with the coins. And that's something that you just don't do. Um, they either hid money or moved money around or something so you couldn't find it or stole something from you that you may be aware of now. Um, mm -hmm. Or withheld something from you or like spread some sort of like rumor to that messed with your finance. They could have caused you to lose a job or jobs, um, convince people not to work with you or something. And and now they're they're going through something, Pisces, that you may not even be aware of. I call this kind of stuff karma though. I ain't gonna lie, karma don't ever forget an address. Karma don't forget a single soul. Um, so if they were sending you through this and found it funny at the time abusing their power, thinking that it was it was hilarious that you were going through some sort of like financial hardships or something. It looks like they are facing something in their life too. It may not be financial hardships, but they are definitely going through some sort of like heartbroken. They're heartbroken about something. They're going through some sort of heartbreaking situation, but they're still in that devil energy though. They're still in that controlling. I need to you know, mess people over, hide stuff, um, sort of energy. But then they want some sort of like celebration with you. Pisces, I don't even see you like, I'm not even trying to be, I don't even see you giving this person the time or day. Um, those wishes for a celebration are, are falling on deaf ears. Like, I just don't see you wanting a connection with them. You've gone through some sort of transformation. What this person meant for evil to hurt you, Pisces, it turned out to be some sort of blessing for you. You could have just, you could have just been like, you know what? I am going to start a new life without this person. Um, so if you all were in a relationship and this person made you feel like you were nothing without them or that you couldn't succeed without them, but they play dirty though. It's like they, if it's like, 
I don't like you. I don't want nobody else to like you. They played dirty though, Pisces. Um, and how they did something. They really did because it looks like they tried to get other people involved in this and it messed with your livelihood in some way. So if you were in a relationship, they could have taken like moved money around throughout like the banks or something. So you couldn't get to it or like um, clean, close the account or cleaned out the account before you could get to it. You know, and take what you're supposed to, to your share and their share. It's like they took both share. Just greed. Just complete greed. Um, just greedy. Did not want to see you with a single dime. And looks like they just played a bunch of mind games. And it and now they have the audacity. So their money could be, their money could have been affected. So for instance, if this person got like some sort of like large windfall or something, they cut you completely out of it. They didn't want you to have a dime, a penny, nothing, a wooden nickel. They wanted to see you suffer financially, possibly be put out, possibly, you know, just all kind of, underhanded stuff right and as time went on Pisces it looks like you found a way to get finances in another way so if they affected your job like if they told your boss something or something like that they told your supervisor something and your supervisor like decided to let you go based on some sort of rumor they heard from this this um Aries Pisces, it looks like they are facing some something in their life right now that has them heartbroken. But like I said, this is nothing but karma because they're still being very devilish about something. They're still hiding stuff. They're still being sneaky. They're still hiding. They're throwing stones and hiding their hands. They're not quite telling you when they come back around, let this person do the talking. Don't talk. Let them do all the talking. They'll reveal something to you Pisces and this just came in like they are going to reveal something to you that you aren't even aware of or that they don't even realize that they revealed to you my nose is itching um this this Aries could be revealing how much of a role they played in something without even realizing so if you all like when they when they come back to have some sort of like conversation with you let them do the talking and then ponder on the relate i mean ponder on the conversation days later like you have you know reflect back to what this aries told you because it's something that they're you may not even realize it when they first say it it's something that they're going to say that's going to be an aha moment for you like oh, i knew they had something to do with that So it's, and it could be your, it's pertaining to your finances though. They're still hiding some. They want you to choose them over something else. So they could even want you to choose them over yourself, Pisces. Um, Pisces, it looks like you, you've gone through a transformation with this person meant to break you and end you wind up rebuilding you, honestly. Like you just found another way to rebuild yourself. And like I said, you could be in the public eye or something. So now this Aries wants to come back. They want to be a part. They want to stand on that platform with you. They want to get public recognition with you. Um, after doing this to you, they know what they did was extremely wrong. So if they withheld money from you, they could have given money to everybody else around them. But they, they gave none to you, Pisces. Um, if they hit, like got some sort of windfall, they could have hit a lottery, it could have been an inheritance, whatever. Um, and in the process of them getting money, they tried to mess with your money. So it was like, they, they felt like they needed money to be successful or something in life, but they did not want to see you be successful. It was like, okay, I'm going to win, but I'm going to make sure you don't. They played really dirty. And people could be aware of this now. They could be very much aware of what this Aries did to you. Um, but it looks like now they're facing some sort of financial difficulties. 
they're facing something like a, something isn't moving forward financially for them the way that they want it to. So people could that know about what they did to you could be thinking like, yeah, like that's called karma. Like it's not going to move fi move forward financially for you because look at how you did Pisces. You held money from Pisces, moved money around, stole money from Pisces, but yet you expect to have all this money coming in. So this Aries could be sitting back contemplating on what they did, thinking about how they handled things with you, knowing that it was really wrong. They're sort of embarrassed, so they could have pulled back from a lot of people who know of the situation of what they did. Um, but they're still being very deceitful about something. They're still hiding something though, Pisces. They are still hiding something. And then we have the eight of, of wands. I mean, I'm sorry, the eight of sports. Yeah. So this, this, this Aries is not, uh-uh. 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 They want, they are, they're still hiding something, keeping something from you. Want you to feel stuck. This Aries is not coming back around. They're coming back around like they're offering you a cup of love. But you had with this, with this eight of swords and this devil card and this death card, I would not deal with a, a person like this. I would not. Mm -mm, no way. Because if somebody messes with your livelihood, they don't care what happened to you. And this, this Aries is still ha is embodying that energy. And we all know that all Aries are not like this. The, whoever this Aries is that's in this reading, this is who they chose to be. This is this does not apply to all Aries Pisces, but this Aries did not do you right, and they know that they didn't. And they're so even though they're sorry for what they did, they still have that devilish energy with them. So this person could be so used to doing dirt that they don't even know any other way in life how to handle problems except to do it in a dirty way, resolve problems, fight dirty. Like they don't know how to do things in the correct way unless they know everybody's watching. Then they'll put on a good show to make it seem like they're a good person. But behind closed doors, it looked like they did a lot of dirt, a lot of dirt. And they could be going through that karma right now because of what they did to you, Pisces. Um, They could be facing some sort of karma right now or feeling like abandoned or left out in the cold or either, you know, they, they had, um, or they could have, like they're facing financial issues or going through a lot of like disagreements with people or something right now. Um, but they're still, they're coming back like they want to offer you some sort of like cup of love or an apology or, you know, they're very optimistic. They feel like if they offer you something that you're going to be, you're going to take the bait. But Pisces, this, this Aries is still hiding something and they do not want you to know about something that they did. They want you all to celebrate without you knowing what they did. They know if you know that you really won't deal with them anymore. You could already feel like, okay, well, you know, if they come by, I'll listen to what they got to say. But it looks like you really are not open to deal with this Aries the way that they want you to deal with them. They want to have some sort of celebration with you without you knowing the role that they played in something. So again, like I said, when they come back and they get to talking, let them do all the talking. They're going, something about a conversation you all are going to have is going to reveal a role that they played in something in your life pertaining to your money. Mm. So, yeah. So, Pisces, it really do look like um, whatever this Aries did to you, it looks like you have overcome it in some way. You overcame what they did and you're doing extremely well right now you could be doing well financially um for yourself and this aries is stalking watching watching the transformation seeing you do good they want to come back around if they're facing financial difficulties after causing so many in your life now they want to come back around and ask for some sort of like help or something um or either they want to collaborate with you in some way. Let me 
just gonna go to Target for you. Let me put up my sign. Okay, um, but they want to collaborate with you in some way, Pisces, or connect with you in some way and celebrate with you. But it's based, I, they're still hiding something. They're still being very devilish and sneaky and hiding something. Um, yeah, they don't want you to know about something that they did or said or something that they didn't do or did not say. They don't want you to know. It's something that they're still hiding, Pisces. The dreams, your dreams need a practical plan. Full moon and Taurus. A Taurus could be involved in this too. Or they did something with a Taurus that they don't want you to know about. Um, your dreams need to be practical, Pisces. So you can get to that point in your life. Um, it looks like you're doing well for yourself though. Like you're rebuilding in some way. So whatever was taken from you or whatever you lost, it looks like you're rebuilding. You're getting it back. Um, if you have not got it back yet, you are going to get it back. Um, but it looks like it may have been a Taurus involved in this with this Aries working together with this Aries to do this to you too. Um, so don't worry about it though. And it looks like they affected your finances in some way. Um, and now people are aware of what happened. They know what happened. And so um, this Aries is not proud of their behavior, but they're still sneaky. They're still hiding something. They're still being devilish. So as much as they may not be proud of it, they not it's not enough for them to change. But anyway, okay, so that is the end of the reading, Pisces. Make sure that you hit that like, share, and subscribe button. I love you guys. Sending you nothing but positive energy. Um, know that we are um, the new moon. I think the new moon is in Libra. I, I, I really do. I think it's, oh yeah, it's in Libra. So we have a new moon in Libra um, for October the 6th which is Wednesday. And um, so like, again, I said that you want some sort of balance and harmony in your life, Pisces. And that's what it looks like that you're looking forward to. So you're not even willing to entertain this Aries right now. Um, just because you could have worked very hard to get a lot to, to recover from what this Aries did to you. And now they want to come back and do even more damage. Like they haven't learned their lesson. This karma, this, this Aries could have faced karma situation after karma situation. You know how somebody get hit on the head 15 times, but they'll keep walking past the same thing that hit them in the head because they haven't learned a thing. So this Aries hasn't quite learned that a lot of the heartache that they face and the karma that they're going through is because of the dirt that they've done to you. So they haven't learned. Oh, well, um, that's the end of the reading. So make sure you hit that like, share and subscribe button. Pisces, thank you for all the donations. I appreciate you guys. Cross watchers, thank you for the donations. I appreciate you guys. Um, I love you. I'm sending you nothing but positive energy. Make sure that you hydrate. Um, go for a walk and get that exercise in and do your thing. I love you. Talk to you soon.